Understanding Juvenile Justice, a guide to the legal system for young offenders. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a very important and interesting topic, juvenile justice. This concept plays a crucial role in legal systems around the world and understanding it will not only help you improve your English, but also give you insights into how societies deal with young offenders. Let's dive in. Juvenile justice refers to the area of law and legal systems that deal with minors, individuals who are not old enough to be held responsible for criminal acts in the same way as adults. The age that separates a juvenile from an adult varies from country to country, but it is generally around 18 years. Juvenile justice focuses on the rehabilitation of these young individuals rather than just punishment. It's a system designed to guide and support rather than to penalize harshly. In this section, let's look at the core principles that guide the juvenile justice system. 1. Rehabilitation and Reintegration The primary goal is to help juveniles correct their behavior and successfully reintegrate into society. 2. Fair and Just Treatment Juveniles have the right to fair treatment in the justice system, respecting their age and development. 3. Involvement of Family Families often play a significant role in the rehabilitation process. 4. Separation from Adults When detained, juveniles are usually separated from adult offenders to protect their safety and well-being. Understanding the process can help clarify how juveniles are treated differently from adults. Let's break it down. 1. Law Enforcement Interaction Police officers often have protocols specifically for dealing with juveniles. 2. Juvenile Court System Many countries have special courts for juveniles with judges specialized in juvenile law. 3. Diversion Programs Often, Juveniles may be diverted to programs focusing on education and counseling instead of going through formal court proceedings. 4. Detention and Rehabilitation If detention is necessary, the emphasis is on rehabilitation and education, aiming for the juvenile's re-entry into society. Juvenile justice isn't without its challenges and debates. Balancing punishment and rehabilitation Finding the right balance between these two can be complex. Variations in legal ages, different countries define the age of a juvenile differently, leading to international debates. Handling serious offenses, determining how to handle juveniles who commit serious crimes is a subject of ongoing discussion. That's all for our overview of juvenile justice. Remember, the focus of this system is on rehabilitation and offering a second chance to young individuals. It's a complex but fascinating aspect of legal systems worldwide. We hope this video has been enlightening and helpful in understanding this important topic. Thank you for watching, and see you in our next video.